Hello my friends, CJ here. We are back on the Paladin today. We are continuing our hardcore challenge. Uh, let's take a quick look uh, just at our classic hardcore stats. As you can see, uh, we are all good. Uh, we pass verification, meaning we haven't died, and <laughs> we are good to go. Uh, we do have um, some quests that we need to do today. Uh, we've got uh, the skirmish at Echo Ridge, where we need to kill 12 of these kobold laborers. Then we do have the bounty on Garrick Padfoot. And then uh, we have Millie's Harvest, where we need to bring eight crates of uh, her grapes. So, I'm thinking we should probably start with the Echo Ridge one. Um, I think that'll probably be the best bet. We'll get those kobolds out of the way. And then, um, then we can focus on uh, the Defias Brotherhood. Um, yeah. I like the Defias Brotherhood. I think they're pretty cool. Um, they kind of got a bad rap, you know. They uh, they really, uh, I guess, Edwin Van Cleef, he's the leader of the Defias Brotherhood, and unfortunately he got screwed over uh, by, like, the nobles in Stormwind, and so that's why he's, uh, he's not too happy with them right now. But uh, it's pretty cool lore, actually. Um, I'm a big fan of Warcraft lore. I really am, so uh, I think it's pretty awesome to learn some of these things. Alright, so these are the ones we need to kill. We need to kill 12 of these laborers, and that's what we're going to do. As you can see now, with the uh, Paladin, um, it's a situation where every time we judge, we are now consuming our seal, uh, which stinks. I personally like the modern, uh, you know, uh, what do you want to say, like the modern way, um, which was introduced in TBC, you know, after you seal, like your seals are up for like 30 minutes, I think is what it is. I much prefer that method. <laughs> Well, my allergies are kicking in today, so I apologize if I sound a little stuffy or something. Yeah, we're going to burn through this quest pretty quick. I am sneezing up a storm. Thankfully for editing, you don't hear it. <laughs> but man, oh man. Something's going on. Well, I gotta say, the uh, first video of our paladin really really like um took off you know it was amazing like i i was surprised at uh how good of a reception that it was going to be i i did not expect it to be like that um so you know thank you to everyone who like watched and commented and it was so cool. Like, you guys rock as a community. I am so fortunate. Like, I honestly believe I have, like, one of the greatest communities uh, in World of Warcraft. You are all just awesome people. And, you know, as a creator, like, it's such a joy to be making content for people who love this game as much as I do, you know? Um, and people who interact. Um, and voice their opinions and, you know, things like that. It's just so cool. So, you know, thank you so much for just being an active, um, you know, member of our community. So you, got, you guys are awesome. All right, that's the last one. 
trying to remember if there's like a quest back here or something. I don't think so. Wasn't there like a gold tooth or something? Could have swore. Well, maybe that's actually. That's actually in uh, the other mine, in Elwyn Forest, I think. Well, I hope you all are having a good day today. I appreciate you taking some time out of your busy day to spend it with me. If you, uh, if this is your first time checking out my content, I just want to say welcome. And thank you for deciding to uh, click on today's video. Um, if you are enjoying this episode, consider liking it. That like actually helps out the channel, uh, helps out the video. It tells the YouTube algorithm that this content is worth promoting. And, you know, I mean, as a content creator, I love it when all my videos get out in front of as many people as possible. Um, and if you're feeling extra generous, uh, consider subscribing. We are now over 520 subscribers, which is so awesome. I just, I never imagined that I'd be at 520 subscribers. It's, it's still so cool to think. Um, but uh, we would love to add you to our community. Um, so consider subscribing. Um, there's going to be a lot more hardcore content. Uh, the hardcore servers are being released here. Um, I think August 24th is what I believe. And so, um, you know, I, I'm going to obviously be bringing more, uh, you know, more content. Um, I'm, I have an eye on the druid, and so I'm thinking maybe we'll be doing a druid, uh, if, you know, if something happens to, you know, one of our characters. Um, but yeah, I, I think a druid is something that I would really like to play. Never played a druid before. But, uh, yeah, you know, like I said, we're gonna have a lot of content, so perhaps, uh, you know, perhaps subscribe. Uh, because that way you won't miss it. Uh, and to my current uh, subscribers, I just want to say thank you. You guys are awesome. Um, your continued support um, means the absolute world to me. Um, you guys are the reason why I, why I continue to you know, make content. Um, so thank you so much. Uh, you guys are, are awesome. Um, all right, let's see now. Here we've got Padfoot right here. I think that's what we need to do. I think we're going to... Let's... We're going to attack him first. And because we can heal, um, I think we're going to be okay. As long as we don't run out of mana. Um... But we're going to give it a shot. Worst case scenario, we just, uh, you know, we have to run away. But we don't have a, uh, you know, we don't have an interrupt right now, so. But I think we're going to be okay. Yeah, like, we totally just did this, so. It's all good. Look at that. All right, cool. We got one more quest to do, and that's Millie's Harvest. We're going to collect uh, eight of these little grapes right here. They're in the buckets. Yeah, I I was really I was really surprised at how good uh, the first video was. Um, you guys knocked it out of the park. Um, clearly you know, people want to see the, the paladin, and, uh, so that, that was, that was cool, I really enjoyed that, I, yeah, oh boy, I am not gonna be doing this, I'm gonna be pulling three people at the same time, no thanks, don't think I can do that, okay, so they're evading, that's cool, We're going to grab him now. But yeah, um, so yeah, uh, it was amazing. I just, uh, I loved, you know, seeing uh, <laughs> the the amount of likes and uh, 
you know, views that were coming in after, you know, for that video it was just, it was like, wow, people really are wanting to see the Paladin, so that is awesome, you know, as a, as a creator, I love it when a video kind of hits the spot for, you know, for the community, so that was, that was cool, that was really cool. I don't know, inventory's full, darn it, that's alright. Let's grab these. So we need what? We need eight of them? Okay. Oh no, my inventory's full. I can't even do that. What the heck? Alright, let's just get rid of that. Alright. These should be able to stack, so it shouldn't be a problem. Let's just clear that out really quick. She's like those stinking kobolds, man. Don't take those grapes. Grapes are mine. <laughs> and here we go with this dude. The other option, too, I was thinking about was uh, a priest. I played priest before. I'm not in the hardcore, but um, I really like the priest actually. Um, there is a I do have a series on the channel um, where I uh, am where I am leveling a priest. I haven't played him in a really long time, but I, I mean there's some good amount of uh, of episodes with him. Um, but I would definitely be down with you know leveling a priest again. Or not again, because I don't have a fully leveled one. But, you know, playing a priest, which eventually we'll get around to anyways, because, um, you know, got to play every class. But, yeah, I enjoy the priest. I, I really do. Um, so that that is always on the table. I think we're going to be done here fairly soon, like after we... Um, after we turn these quests in, like, I think our next stuff is to head to, um, Goldshire, I think. If I remember right, I don't think there's really much else around here. Alright, quest is done. We are going to... We're gonna level. I, I guarantee you we're gonna level once, uh, once we turn this stuff in. All right, let's turn this one in for Millie. How are you? Do you have my harvest, Markor? I do. Oh, thank you, Markor. You saved my harvest, and I hope you showed a few of those Defias that they can't cause trouble around here. I sure did. We might be short on guards these days, but we're lucky uh, to have heroes like you to protect us. That's right. Where's my reward? Just joking. Uh, now that my crop is saved, take this great manifest to Brother Neil's. He manages the store of foods and drink in Northshire, and I'm sure he'll be delighted to hear that he has fresh grapes. You'll find Brother Neil's in the Abbey, in the Bell Tower, where he likes to taste his wine. All right, cool. So we got to take, uh, we got to, you know, bring the great manifest to Brother Neil's, and we're going to get, uh, looks like we're going to get a new belt. So that's cool. The dude's up later. in uh, the Bell Tower drinking his wine, man. Sounds like a good gig. Let's go turn these other ones in. Alright, bounty on Garrick Padfoot. Did you find Garrick's shack? Are we finally free of that villain? Ah, you caught him. You've done Elwyn a great service and earned a nice bounty. Alright, let's see. We got leather, cloth, and a cloak. Um, I mean, we'll take this. It's barely better see than the around. one we have now, but, you know, it works. 
Let's, uh, let's do something really quick. Let's just free up some bag space because... Greetings. Um, yeah. Because we might need to. Uh, let's see. Oh, wow. Yeah, like... Oh, goodness. You know what? We're gonna do this Light really quick. You. Let's... Let's put these pants on, or these trousers or whatever, those pants. Uh, this, f yep, this male tunic. We've got some boots that are what we're going to be rocking. That'll definitely help us. Let's see, we got a male waist. Uh, let's see, oh yeah, look at that. We got a better hammer. Uh, let's see, frayed cloak. 34... Okay, now, now I think we can like go ahead and you. sell. All right, we gotta keep those. Uh, we gotta keep these, you know, fresh gear going, right? Especially when we're uh, doing the hardcore challenge. All right, let's. Uh, yeah, we'll clean up. Cool. For the alliance. All right, very good. Now let's go turn this in. King's honor, friend. All right, skirmish at Echo Ridge. Once again, you've earned my respect and the gratitude of the Stormwind Army. There may yet be kobolds in the mine, but I will marshal others against them. We have further tasks for you. All right, so we can choose the outfitter. Oh yeah, that's a lot better than the ones we have. Report to Goldshire. Markor, you are a paladin with proven interests in the security of Northshire. You are now tasked with the protection of the surrounding Elwyn Forest. Take Marshal McBride's documents to Marshal Duggan in Goldshire. All right. Well, we get a we get a shield, but um, we're not really going to be leveling as Rhett. So uh, the shield, yeah, that's okay. I think we'll just sell it. Usually, I level as Prot. I really do, but this time around, I'm going to just level as uh, as Retribution. You know, that way, I think uh, everything will just die a lot faster. Hey there. All right, you look to be in fine spirits. Come, have a seat and drink. Let's see here. Oh my, Millie's grapes have been saved. When she told me that uh, brigands overrun her vineyards, I nearly despaired, but my faith in the light did not waver. And through your bravery, we now have grapes for more wine. May the light bless you, Markor, and keep you safe. All right, we got a wine-stained cloak or this uh, latched belt. Well, we're going to take the belt. See you later. Cool. All right, let's, uh, let's put on our boots and our new belt. All right, cool. All right, nice. Like I said, we are now heading out to Goldshire. Um, I, I, like I said before, I love the leveling experience in, uh, El, in Northshire Abbey, Northshire Valley. It's really good. It's really concise. It's fast. Um, it doesn't waste a lot of time. And, uh, so yeah, it's, it's good. I, it's, I like what it a lot. For you? All right. Don't think there's anything to train because we're not level six yet, but we get Holy Right, Holy Light rank two, a divine protection, which is great. So this one, we're protected from all physical attacks and spells for six seconds. Um, but obviously, during that time, we cannot attack or use any physical abilities. So, you know, we're kind of like an, like an immunity, but we can't do anything about it. So it is handy, though, but we at least can run away. And then Seal of the Crusader. Uh, so it fills the Paladin with the Spirit of the Crusader for 30 seconds, granting 31 melee attack power. Paladin also attacks 40% faster, but deals less damage with each attack. Um, so that is what we're going to do, too. Um, I'm going to check and see, like, with the Hardcore Challenge, I'm not necessarily going to... I don't think I'm going to train all my abilities. I'm just going to train train ones that I think are going to be more um, advantageous and more kind of bang for your buck because, uh, you know, gold is going to be... Um, you know, gold's gonna be a thing, and I don't be want. I don't want to waste um, gold on um, uh, on abilities that really aren't gonna do me any good. So I'm just kind of putting it out there. So if you see something like, dude, why didn't you train rank two of this? Well, it's probably because 
I don't think it's worth it. So, but feel free to always let me know. Um, so yeah. All right. Rest and relaxation. Every adventurer should rest when exhaustion sets in. And there is no finer place to get rest and relaxation than at the Lion Prides Inn. I agree with you. I love the Lion Prides Inn. My best friend innkeeper Farley runs the Lion's Pride. If you tell him I sent you, he may give you the special discounted rates on food and drink. To find the Lion Prides Inn, travel south along the road from here. You can't miss it. All right, we'll get a uh, small pumpkin. Safe travel. Goodies like that. Cool. I this I remember vividly. Uh, my very first time exiting here and going to Goldshire. I remember this and thinking to myself, like, wow, I am now going on an adventure. Like, I have no idea what this world is going to have in store for me. Um, it was magical, and it still is magical. Everything about L1 Forest is fantastic. I love the music, I love the ambience, I love the scenery. It's just like your quintessential, you know, RPG, uh, you know, just like human settlement, whatever. Like, it's just quintessential, like RPG. I, it reminds me so much of, you know, Lord of the Rings and, and just all that stuff. So it's, it's just great. I absolutely love Elwyn Forest. All right. Here's our well, friend Marshall Duggan. Report to Goldshire. You have word from McBride. Northshire is a garden compared to Elwyn Forest, but I wonder what Marshall McBride has to report. Here, let me have his papers. You have... Okay, there we go. Sorry. Well, it says here that you've been awarded acting deputy status with the Stormwind Marshals. Congratulations, and good luck. Keeping Elwyn safe is no picnic. What with most the army busy doing who knows what for who knows which noble. It's hard to keep track of politics in these dark days. Alright, the Fargo Deep Mine. The mine in Northshire isn't the only one with problems. I have reports that the Fargo Deep Mine in Elwyn has also become a haven for kobolds. Explore the mine and confirm these reports, then return to me. The mine is almost due south of Goldshire, between the Stonefield and McClure homesteads. Alright, so we're going to explore the Fargo Deep Mine. Be careful. That's the mine that has a gold tooth in it. Um, so we're definitely going to... You know, I... Uh, I kind of have an, an... You know... I kind of have some hesitancy about doing the mine thing, because lately I haven't had any good luck with doing, like, caves and crap like that, but... I think we'll be all right. Hello. I, so. I mean, we can heal ourselves at least, so that's always good. But I also could do that on this shaman, so uh, <laughs> we're not going to talk about that. All right, rest and relaxation. Uh, rest and relaxation for the tired and cold. That's our motto. Please take a seat by the fire and rest your weary bones. Uh, would you like to try a sampling of some of our fine food and drink? All right. Well, let's just take. Uh, let's. Well. Uh, We'll do... We'll do the refreshing water. Have a good one. Look at that. Level six. Sweet. All right, cool. Uh, let's go and... There's some more quests around here. So I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and gather some quests. And then uh, we're going to kick off a proper Elwyn Forest playthrough you. on the next episode. All right, gold dust exchange. The kobolds in these parts sometimes carry gold uh, gold dust on them. I could really use the stuff. Bring me a load of it, and I'll give you the best price in town. Or, best price in town. What? I'll give you the best price in town. Best price in town. Okay, whatever. Uh, you can find kobolds in the Fargo Deep Mine to the south and around the Jasper Load Mine to the northeast. All right, so bring 10 gold dust to Remy two times in Goldshire. Safe travel. We can do that. And there is another one. Oh, shoot. There was that one that was in uh, 
in the inn here that I should have grabbed, but I didn't. I think this is a thing to storm Hello. wind. Uh, bring eight large candles. No, this isn't it. All right, my brother and I run an Apothecarian Stormwind, and I'm here to gather large candles for their wax. Can you help me? Uh, you can get large candles from kobolds, and I hear rumors that kobolds are infesting the Elwyn Mines. The Fargo Deep Mine to the south and Jasper Lode Mine to the east. I suggest looking for candles in one of those places. All right, we're going to give you these eight candles. Also, before we do this, I want to make sure we set our hearth. Only the Let's do that. Sweet. All right, we are good there. So now, let us go and train. We've got... Uh, let's see if we can sell some stuff in here really quick. Can I help you? No, nope, don't want to be trained. I just want to sell. Looking for something specific. All right, so yeah, we can get rid of this. We don't need the shield. Um, let's get rid of that apple. I don't really care about that. This male belt we can get rid of as well. All right, so we got two silver, fourteen copper. Let's uh, let's take a look. Here's the paladin train. Need help? Uh, holy light. That's one silver. Divine Protection is a silver. And Seal of the Crusader. Alright, so... Let's take Divine Protection definitely. Because if something goes bad down in the mine, or, you know, we need a... You know, we need a get-out-of-jail-free card, then we're good with that. Um, and then... Let's see. Uh, 35 mana. 60 mana. That's just... That's a lot of mana. I'm going to wait and see... I'm going to do a little research and see which uh, spells I really need to grab, I think. Because, uh, like, like I said, I, I want to be super efficient on, on what we do. Um, but, uh, yeah, like, honestly, we're awesome, you know? Like, we got out of Northshire. Uh, now we're in the big world. We're in Goldshire, ready to kick off our Elwyn Forest. But, uh, yeah, I, I'm having... I have good feelings about the Paladin. I, um... We're going to do some, some fun things with him, I think. Well, my friends, that's going to do it for today. As always, thank you for taking time out of your busy day to spend it with me. If you enjoyed today's episode and you'd like more content from yours truly, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I'll see you in Azeroth.